with a Zen watch. Asus's first foray into the world of smartwatches was a bit of a letdown. The Android Wear-powered wearable made a few hardware fumbles, chief among them a failure-prone heart rate sensor and uncomfortable wrist strap. It also shipped with redundant, bothersome software and carried a $200 dollar price tag that limited its appeal in comparison with more capable and unique smartwatches like and that's not to say the Zen watch didn't have good ideas XA0 its handsome design and interchangeable 22 mm strap were rarities among smartwatches XA0 but it never felt like more than the sum of its parts the Zen watch too feels just as solid sturdy and light as its predecessor the Zen watch was released in 2014 XA0 The year smartwatches really began to enter the public consciousness. Now the race to consumers' wrists has never been fiercer. The Apple Watch is no longer a rumor. Circular smartwatches, a novelty in 2014, are commonplace. LG, Huawei, Pebble, and Samsung now offer round designs. And some of the biggest names in luxury wrist wear, like Tagger, Bulgari, Bridling, and guests, have announced plans for smartwatches of their own. It's in this suffocating climate that Asus debuts the Zen Watch 2. With it, the company hopes to undercut the competition on price, while retaining the original Zen Watch's great hardware. The Zen Watch 2 is a good deal cheaper than its predecessor, starting at $129. Comes in more sizes and configurations and features slightly improved hardware, but unfortunate concessions, like the substitution of cheaper materials and the omission of a heart rate monitor, work to undermine that vision. The first thing you'll probably notice about the Zen Watch 2 is how remarkably similar it looks to its predecessor. That's true of both the larger, 49mm, and smaller, 45mm, model although the latter differs.